Lear Hollis, Jefferson, and Cleef Wyatt. Questions for student athletes? Rod Lear, this is by far and away your most complete game of the season. 23 points, 18 rebounds, 5 assists. Can you just talk about your performance tonight? I mean, just came out aggressive, and my teammates were looking for me, and I was able to knock down my shots tonight, and just had it going. There was a point there where they were coming back, and I think you, you guys were up 22 at one point. And it looked like maybe you took your foot off the gas a little bit, but you had, I think you had three straight stickbacks um, that kind of, <coughs> how did you guys feel about where you were and all of a sudden where they were? And when they were getting close about that point, they were within nine, I think. I mean, uh, when we were up there, we didn't want to take our foot off the title, but they were able to get into the game by getting to the basket. And when we got, when we seen that they were getting closer, we uh, decided that we had, had to stop that right there. And, we were, I was able to get tip-ins and Lee started making shots. Did you see your stats? Have you ever had seven offensive boards? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Khalid, can you just talk a little bit about uh, Lewis' performance, especially because you're accustomed in the game, you know, you guys going through you for the offense, but he was there to make several shots back to back to back. Yeah, uh, I mean, Rod was big for us today. And, uh, I mean, he's been, been big for us all year. I mean, with Rod, you. I mean, you're not going to get performance like that, but he's going to play hard every game. He's going to give you great effort every game. So, I mean, it was it was pretty cool just to see him out there having fun and, and enjoying the moment. And, I mean, at the end of the game, the ball was in my hands, and I think they were paying a lot of attention to me. And I trust Riley to make shots, and Riley made some big shots. So, I mean, he didn't make Riley, a lot of times you ask the guard guys that are 6'10", 6'11", when they have four guards on the floor, you can guard a wing or guard a guard. It, and, a lot of times you fuel your game off of defense. How much did that? How much did that help you tonight to do what you did overall? I mean, defense is an everyday thing for me, so that's nothing new. I can guard the bigs or guard a guard, and I was able to do that tonight. When even when they went five guards. If there was a moment where they cut it to nine, and you helped to create or score seven straight points on uh, three different possessions. Can you talk about what that moment was like for you? And did you think that you know, in your role in this team, on this team, you had to do what you did? In that, in that? Yeah, I think uh, I think my teammates depend on me to, uh, to make good plays uh, when we need them, and uh, they made a they made a nice run and they got back in the game. And, and Coach Dunf, he put the ball in my hands, and uh, I wasn't scoring the ball, but I was I was trying to make plays for my teammates and uh, and just try to get take what the defense gave me. So. But yeah, when, they, when the game gets close and they start, they started coming back. Uh, my teammates, they trusted me with the ball and just try to reward them. Do you really understand what that moment kind of meant? I mean, the NCAA tournament bid, looming, a ten seeding, Big Five championship share, and, and you know, if they score a couple more buckets. It's a much game. Yeah, we knew this game. Uh, we knew how much this game meant for us. I mean, we need, we need every game right now. So uh, we're just gonna take it one game at a time, and and we're just gonna. I'm not gonna try to look too far ahead. Just, just now, just enjoy this tonight, and then it's on to uh, Charlotte. So try to prepare for them. Khalif, you guys went on an 18-1 run to end the first half. Um, what was going so well through that time? Actually, I think it was our defense. Uh, we was getting stops, and we was cl we was holding them to one shot. And I mean, when you play good defense, we was getting out of transition. Guys were making shots. Jake made a couple shots. Scooty made a couple shots. So. I mean, I think our defense actually sparked the offense in the first half, so that was big for us. They haven't been on this big a stage in a long time. You guys aware of that? LaSalle. Think about it? Yeah. Well, and you've been on a big stage every year. Yeah, LaSalle, this, they got a good team. They got some Philly guys who are going to play hard, and they're going to be tough. But, I mean, those guys, they, they came out there, and they play hard. And I just think we had some, we played with some good intensity, and, and Raleigh and Scooby, they brought some energy. And they made some energy plays, like create loose balls, and we was getting we were getting all the loose balls. So I just think that we uh, we played pretty good today. And, and I think we saw play hard though. Cool. What does this victory say about y'all? I mean, you guys been up and down for a while, but what does this victory say about you guys? I think I think we uh I think we showed what we could do, and we we focused for 40 minutes. I think we uh we came out there, we had a mindset that we was gonna we was gonna play together, we was gonna play together on both ends, and for 40 minutes, I think we we, we, we did that, and uh, we came out with a big win that we needed. Cleek, they, they shot it better in the second half, but in the first half, you guys defended probably as well as you have 
all year. What, what changed? Is it, was it just better effort, better execution? Where did that come from? Because you guys have been so uneven at that end of the floor, and tonight was a completely different story. I think, um, I mean, I don't really know, but I know we gave great effort on defense, and we, 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 limited, to, we, limited, we limited them to one shot, so, I mean, that was a big thing for us. We was contesting shots. They hit some tough shots, even in the second half. I think Tyreek Durant made some, some really hard shots, but he made them. But, I mean, I think we was we just paid attention to details. They took some tough shots, and we limited them to one shot. So, that was big for us. How happy were you to see uh, Scooty, you know, put together a big game, 15 points, 10 rebounds, 4 assists? I mean, yeah, I was, I was happy for him. I saw, I mean, the way he was just moving today, he was just moving, just, he had a, he had a hop in his step, and he had his confidence, and kept going to him, and he was, he was crashing the offensive glass, like, nobody could box him out. He was just, like, out there, like, running through brick walls. So he was, like, I mean, he just, he had a lot of energy, and he was having fun, and, I mean, I was, I was really happy for him. Do you think you guys have played defense this well all year? I think what frustrates Temple fans sometimes is you guys look like you're capable of playing this kind of defense all the time, but don't always do it. You think that's accurate? That's, is that fair? Yeah, I mean, we've definitely been inconsistent on the defense end, but we definitely showed some stretches that we can guard. But we just got to put it together for, for 40 minutes. Uh, I think in the second half th today, they just were uh, – Trying to, they were just running it down. The they were just getting it out. They weren't running any sets. They were just going to the basket, putting their head down, making plays. But I mean, I think, I think we just take it one game at a time, and we'll try to build off of this, and we'll go to Charlotte. We'll try to, we we'll try to put together another good defensive effort. Earlier, you hit multiple jumpers in the second half. Two of them from that same spot on the baseline. Can you just talk about how you developed your jumper over four years and how hard you worked on it? Um, I mean. Uh, <laughs> I've just been working very. I've been working very hard. I've been in the gym with coaches, just getting up a lot of shots, uh, just getting reps up. They always tell me it's just repetition, and that's what I've been doing, so I can be consistent with my jump shot. Khalif, when you guys got Tyreek in the in the foul trouble, did they look like did they look like a disjointed team when when he's off the floor, just because of what he does as their floor general? Yeah, I think they definitely missed him in that first half because. Uh, he gets them in their sets and he controls their tempo. Like they play at a good pace usually, and Tyreek is the catalyst for that. And he keeps them. He he makes plays for everybody. So when he went out. They kind of. Uh, I mean, they somebody else had to run their offense, and so we try to take advantage of that. Try to pressure a little bit, speed them up maybe. And yeah, I mean, it definitely was big. Tyreek getting five trouble early, so. Trying to take advantage of that. Khalif, there was a lot of talk about this game leading up to it, a lot of hype. Uh, what does it feel like in practice this week, getting ready for this big game? Uh, this is probably the most excited. I don't know why, but I guess because everybody was talking. And it kind of showed, it was, I was probably the most excited I've been to play because, I mean, everybody was talking about it and it was for the Big Five Championship and we needed it. And uh, it actually showed a little bit. I was kind of going fast. Like, I was I was excited. So I was going fast and turning the ball a little bit, but I was excited and I mean, I was just happy to be out there with my teammates competing, and uh, we came out with a big win. I'm just happy for us. Yeah. I know you guys will say every win is important, but does this feel more personally satisfying than the Syracuse win because of the, the few weeks that, that led up to it? Yeah, I mean, down the stretch, we need all these wins. So every win from now on is going to be the best win we ever had. So we just want to we just want to get as many as we can and and just take it one game at a time and and just get back to get back to preparing for for Charlotte and. Trying to go down there and get a big win. Anything else? Thanks, guys. Great coach.